today we're gonna make a healthy garden and it's gonna have strawberry ladybugs in it and mandarin butterflies and sweet candy flowers and we're gonna have the grass we made of like coconut shavings with food coloring. It's gonna be a lot of fun, so let's get started. All right, so the first thing that we have to do, so listen girls, what we gotta do is open up a bag of M&Ms. I couldn't find the spring color ones, the pastel colors, but this will do, it's okay. And I'm gonna pour it all in the middle. But listen, this is the challenge right here. What you have to do is separate all the colors, okay? So first we have to separate all the different colors. It's gonna make it a lot easier to make the candied flowers, okay? Wow, good job separating it, girl. Look at all those colors. We've got orange, we've got red, we've got green, yellow, and blue. And then, looks like they moved the brown over here. Wow! Yeah! Next, what we have to do is just grab some pretzels and just line it up, okay? You don't want it on top of each other. So just take turns putting them in there, okay? There you go, and spread them out like that. Grab these white baking chocolate chips. You could also use the melting chocolate wafers, but we didn't have that. And what you want to do is put them in each of the holes you see on the pretzel here. Can you do that? Just like that. These are so yummy. Mm -hmm. We don't got a couple more. Let's go. You guys know what that is? Hmm. Taste it and let me know what you think. These are coconut shreds. And you know what? This is gonna this is gonna be our grass. I don't want you think it looks like grass yet? I want no. You no. What color is grass supposed to be? Green. Green. So what we're gonna do is open up your baggies here and pour the shredded coconut into your bag. <laughs> One squirt in there, one little tiny squirt. There you go, that's good. Now it's Neve's turn. That's good, good job. And then close the bag all the way, okay? Make sure you want to lay it flat, close the bag all the way. Okay, you want to hear that little click when it comes together. Weep. There you go. All right, now you can smush it all around. Shake it. And shake it. Use your hand, smush it up. We're gonna make some grass out of coconut shreds. Hey, Matt, it's not coming to no, me. Just keep shaking, keep shaking it. See how it's just keep shaking it? There you go. All right, we need a little bit more food coloring, don't we? I'm gonna do two drops. Okay. There you go. Let's 
good. Hi, Mama. One more. What color did it turn to in the bag? Green! Alright, so while the girls are shaking up their coconut shreds making grass, I'm going to pop this in the oven. It's going to be the lowest temperature you've got on the oven. And it doesn't have to be in there too long. Just enough to where you see the chocolate start to melt. Let me see what it looks like now. Show me. Whoa! Oh. Next, what we're gonna do is use these trays to hold our healthy garden that we get to eat. Okay, so you wanna pour it and move it towards the bottom because that's where the grass is going to be, okay? Mommy, mine looks like lettuce. It kinda does look like lettuce, huh? What does that look like, Sissy? Green! Green grass. Green grass. So now what we're going to do is put the M&Ms on and let me show you an example of what you want to do, okay? So we already had our M&Ms all separated in different colors. So the reason why we want to do that is because the way you want to make the flower is you want to have one color in the middle and then the, all the other colors around it would be another color, okay? So I'm going to choose the middle to be a yellow. Okay, like this. Whoa! I will choose mine to be. And then Whoa. I'm gonna do the blue all around it. I'm gonna do red in the middle. I'm kind of getting it. And then the chocolate. And then blue. You see how I went around like that? Just like that. Cute little flower. <laughs> Do you like how that looks? Mommy, I like how it, this looks. Hey, Lala. Yeah. So these are the ones that Mommy did here. One in the center and then another color all around. And then these, they did a little bit different. They just kind of filled the holes. And you know what? It's okay because all flowers are different. They look different. And you know what? Look at Nave's pretty shirt. What do you have on your shirt, Nave? Um, different kind of flowers, yeah. but some of them are different. Yeah, we have all different some, kinds of flowers. And some, of them, and some of them are different shapes. Yeah, so just like these pretzel flowers that we made, Mommy did it one way, looks like this, and then you guys did it this way. Looks mm -hmm. very beautiful. work on our mandarin butterflies. Mandarin butterflies! Yeah, so what I have here are two mandarins for each of you. If you could just peel that for me, that would be awesome. So then you want to find a piece that has three segments in there. So you got one, two, and then three. Flip that up, and then you take one pretzel, put it there, and then run pretzel, put it in the other. Then there's our butterfly. Oh, good butterfly. Butterflies, I will put my oh. butterfly on the flower because butterflies really like, because butterflies really like flowers just like honeybees does. And, and also, honeybees get, get, get honey from, from flowers. Yeah, they get the pollen and they spread the pollen to the flower so they can grow. Yeah. 
Look Check it out, Dad. Mine. Look at our beautiful butterflies. Wow. Mm -hmm. That looks so cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. shreds that's our grass on the bottom of a baking sheet right here it's gonna hold our whole healthy garden okay yeah so now let's assemble let's put together the flowers so this part right here this is the celery that mom washed and cut up really thin and let me show you an example of what we're gonna do okay I'll do it on Nia's put one down like that oh and then take one of your flowers and then put it right on Oh. Look at the pretty flower. Oh. Here, I'll give you some. And then you can do some too. Can there you go. Yeah, but you want to spread it out, okay? Nice and spaced out. I will choose this one because it's my last one. I'm going to do a yummy. Yummy. I think there's going to be some too. want to do is get the butterflies on there so where's the butterfly normally where do you see it it's normally around the flowers up in the sky right and it's also in on the flower yeah so since it, these right here they were kind of falling apart I'm gonna pick it up for you but you can tell me where you want to put it okay okay, okay. all right Neve where do you want your first butterfly right here, right here by this flower this, this is how it's going to be on the flower. Right here. Let's do another one here. Where do you want this one? Maybe on the other side of it? Okay, where do you want this, Nia? Right here. Okay, that's okay. We can just keep rearranging when we're all done. So now for the ladybug, mommy's gonna have to help you a little bit because we have to put chocolate on it, but it's super messy. But I need your help first to put the body mommy, together. I'll do the sky. The way you want it to look is you grab one strawberry and you see where there's a the little V shape right there. Mm -hmm. You're gonna grab the blueberry and just put it right in front like that. Oh. Okay. So you can pick up a strawberry. That's mine. Okay. Where do you want this one? Mommy, what about the eyes? And then you gotta put a blueberry on there. Good job. And then you need one more. I have one ladybug, two ladybug, three ladybug, four ladybug, five ladybug. And two butterflies like you, Nia. Now, I want to give you a really fun thing to do while I do the little details on the ladybug with the chocolate, okay? Because it's a little messy, so you want mom to do it. I thinly sliced some apples right here, and we have some little cookie cutters. And what you can do is place it on there. Come find one that's big enough for the cookie cutter. And just push it right on there. And then you're going to make more butterflies. Because this is a butterfly shape right there. So while the girls are cutting their apples, 
with the cookie cutter. I'm going to do the little bit more messy part. I melted some chocolate in a Ziploc baggie here, and I'm going to use this to put the details on the ladybugs.